Okay, it's a muddy mess out here, but I kind of want to give you guys an idea of this paddock paradise or um, horse track system that I'm going to work on this year. And here is my little sketch of our piece of property we're going to do. So this little square here is our barn. And then, of course, the blue is our pond. <clears throat> it's almost empty right now, but it's over there. Basically, the idea is we use the perimeter, existing perimeter of our fencing, and then kind of double fence along inside. That's that red fence here to create like this alleyway. And then more narrow spaces encourage forward movement. Um, and then these bigger spaces can be utilized for like resting or eating. Um, you could do like sand pits for rolling in. Um, so that's the idea with the Paddock Paradise. Of course, all of this will be off limits, especially to Maggie, but uh, we'll be putting the donkeys and Maggie on this, um, hopefully grass-free track system. So what we would do is open up the gate and they would be allowed to have movement down here. We're gonna keep the water down here where we actually have a spigot, um, but hay will be kind of scattered in small feeding bags um, throughout the track to encourage movement um, like a natural horse would move. So of course the idea is that they won't get fed except at night. They won't get fed at the barn um, so that, well hi Nikki, so that they will need to move around and get exercise. So here's the general concept. Here's a little barn with Margarita hanging out. And the idea is, even though this isn't done yet, um, but this run here, I just took down this front part of the gate and I need to still put up the rest of the tape. But I have this little alleyway and the narrow parts encourage forward movement. And then in that pink bag is some hay for Margarita and whoever else wants to come on out here. And uh, so yeah, it's just encouraging them to wander around and find their food. Probably too sunny to see, but Margarita's standing over there thinking about whether she wants to walk out here for her hay. So this is the area where the track is at and I'm gonna guess it's less than half an acre so it's like a mini track that we're testing out and I made some modifications so I'll walk you through it real quick. So basically it comes right off of the barn. Uh, this is their dry lot area and I take the little gate down and they can enter here. These narrow passages are to encourage forward movement and it comes down here to uh, a wider area. So this wider area here is for hanging out and eating. So I have some hay bags down here set up. Um, a little log to scratch on. There's a goat bed, a couple of hay pillows. And then it wraps around and has another little narrow corridor right here. Come up this little hill to the this kind of ledge around the pond. So the pond's really low right now. Um, it'll be full when the irrigation's back on. But we kind of have this natural track around the pond. And I've scattered some hay 
along the way just so that they can kind of get used to the pattern of the track. So another kind of wider area here to hang out. And this is kind of nice because it's a higher vantage point. So they do like to hang out up here already um, and take in the scenery. And the track just follows along this ridge of the pond. So it's really windy today. Comes along this ridge. This is the back of the barn. And then for now, I have it just exiting right here. And there are water stations right there. So if you can see, like right there is where we entered. And then right here is an exit. Of course, they can go any direction they want. But that's the track.